I thought we were going up to the surface. Ryla, are you sure this is right? This tunnel is sloping down. Right as raisins, Tracker. When you're in a cave, sometimes you have to go down to go up. Copy that. We'll keep going north. As I live and breathe, an underground lake. So that's where all the water on the surface went. There must be another creature trapped down here. We gotta find it. Hello, I'm Tracker. Hello, Tracker. I'm a Natterjack Toad, but you can call me Nat. What are you doing down here? Oh, I ended up here when the lake drained into the underground tunnels. It happens all the time. Well, we're heading up to the surface, Nat. Why don't you swim over here and join us? Well, <laughs> the thing is, Natterjack Toads aren't good at swimming. Do you mind taking this, Uncle Buck? <laughs> well, good thing I earned my Polar Scout's merit badge for swimming. <laughs> We prepare for everything. Did you prepare for that? Lila! That's me! Oh, good! You won't believe this. I think I found the missing lake. Yep. Lakes called Turlows sometimes drain into underground lakes and disappear down here. But when there's a heavy rainstorm, the tunnels can flood and the lake on the surface will reappear. Tweet to Rala. The rain's coming down in buckets now. You better hurry. Ooh-wee. This cave could flood lickety split. On our way, Tweet. Uh, the water's rising. No worries. We just need to swim across here to get to the chimney sinkhole and we're out. Ooh. It's OK, Nat. Hop on. Um, Natterjack Toads can't really hop, either. We only walk. Right. I've got you, then. Ryla, lead us up. Almost there. Just into this tunnel. Oh, oh, would you believe it? My antler is stuck. Ryla, can you take Nat? I'll try to get butt free. Righto, Tracker. I'll circle back as soon as I get our friend up to the surface. <laughs> nice work. Shiver me whiskers. It's dark in here. I'm getting hungry. Barney Patty? Mmm. <laughs> I'll uh, save it for later. Which way should we go? I see you go with the flow. If the wet is not this way, we come back and try the other way. No, 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 matey. Let's do this the pirate way. A pirate jugs, of course, and sail straight for the... I'll go this way. Looks like it's decided then. You and I will go down this tunnel. I'll lead the way. We know this wetter lives in the dark, so he could be anywhere. Quasi, Pani, I forgot to tell you something about cave wetters. Don't startle them. If you do, they're likely... Shellington? <sighs> We're so deep underground, the radio on the Octo Watch won't work. <gasps> Did you see that? See what? I'm not sure. It could have been a wetter, or maybe a spider? A spider? Um, new plan. You lead the way from now on. Are you afraid of spiders? <laughs> Me? Whatever gave you that idea? I don't suppose you're in trouble, are you? You mean, apart from dangling off a ledge? Uh, no, I don't think so. <laughs> I've got you, matey! <laughs> oh, sweet. That was a close one. Ah, there you are. As I was saying, cave wetters are likely to jump out to anyone who surprises them. Yes, all right. We're kind of the jump first and ask questions later type of wetter. No worries, me hearty. That's the pirate way, too. All right, back into the dark for me. So long. 
Well, looks like we just went on one big wild wetter chase. All the wetters we found seemed okay to me. But that bird definitely told me he saw a wetter in trouble. Wait, what did that bird look like? Um, let me think. Uh, pink legs, uh, black wings, and a thin bill. The black wing stilt. That's the one. And they only live in an area near Lake Tasman. Which means we've got to go right back to where we started. This could take a while. Maybe I can squeeze through that gap in the rocks. Okay, Peso. But be careful. Looks like a dead end. Don't think I can move this rock. <laughs> wow! I'm stronger than I thought. Oh! Oh, I suppose it was you who moved that rock, wasn't it? Mm hmm Thank you. Hi, so you're here. And this must be Kato. I'm Peso, and I'm here to help. Now hold still. <laughs> there. Is that better? <sighs> yes. I think I can stand now. <sighs> That's one problem solved, but we still need to find a way out. Gemma and I could scout for another exit. But hey, where's Gemma? I'll use my wonder cam to search the caves. We'll find Gemma, I promise. Come on, Gemma. Where are you? <gasps> Found her! Gemma, are you okay? Oh, hello. I'm fine. I hoped I would find the way out for everyone and prove what a good leader I could be. But I did not. <laughs> Maybe you did. Mmm, these air currents smell fresh. Must be coming from outside. Mm -hmm. The air's coming from that way. Oi! There's an opening! And I hear rushing water outside. Hey, Gemma. Looks like you found a way out after all. Assuming we can widen it. Leave that to us. This should be much easier than trying to dig through the cave-in. Elephants, form a trunk brigade. <laughs> You're leading us back to the cave? But we'll be trapped. Don't worry, I have a plan. <laughs> I've got a joke for you now. What has four ears, two tails, an eye patch, and a sock puppet? Oh, dinner! What's that? Who cares? Run! I think that did the trick, Captain. Let's get out of here. There must be an easier meal out there somewhere. Yeah. With no signal, we can't use the map on our octo watches. Like I always say, a back up gets your back out. This compass should point us in the right direction. <gasps> Look, poor prince. Maybe it's the new species you've been looking for, Shellington. Or maybe it's a cave monster. A ferocious beastie. God in his cave pearl treasure, forcing any pirate who dares trespass on his domain to solve a riddle or a math problem or a recipe for tapping out the pudding. And if he gets the answer wrong... Ha! Huh. These prints look feline to me. I'm feline too, Shellington. And these cat paw prints are much bigger than mine. Something's found its way in from that direction. That means there's a way out. Oh. Cave monster. Quasi. In all my years of caving, I've never seen a cave monster. Well, there's something stalking us. And now I know why. We found its cave pearl treasure trove. Quasi, um, I don't think that's such a good idea. What? I'm not afraid of any scallywag cave monster. <sighs> The 
good news is, I'm pretty sure we've made it to the main chamber. And the bad news? I lost my compass in the rapids. Ah, don't worry, mateys. The other Octonauts will find us. Unless that creature finds us first. Uh, which way now? Only one way to tell for sure. The pirate way. Because a pirate never loses his sense. Yeah! Oh, right then, we don't go this way. Ah, uh, I found it! The way out? No, but I think I've discovered a new species of woodlouse. Woodlice on the surface are dark coloured, but creatures who live in the dark are often white or have no colour at all. That's nice. Now, would you mind shining that light somewhere else? It's hurting my eyes. Oh, sorry. Ahoy, matey. I'm Quasi, and this is Shellington and Ryla. Any chance you know the way out of here? Well, I don't know which way is out because I can't see from living in the dark. But I could tell you that that way is cold and wet. And that way is warm and dry. Warm and dry means sunlight, and sunlight means a way out.